The two teams, shall we? Season between them. And that is something There's still that, a chance, and hopefully it'll get them across the line. Floated towards goal, but not enough on that to cause... They always play best when they're a front foot and when they've got that high press. No, it was actually a foul, and by the look on Lindsay Johnson's face, it probably was. <laughs> I think, I think uh, Jill Rowe got the ball, but... Uh, Williams just couldn't complete the pass. Got to play it down there, Alexandri. Hasegawa. In the dressing room, on the pitch, leader. Katie Zellum. Meanwhile, Khadija Shaw is down in the D. That comes from that, that sort of data-driven... Turned away by United. Stats have been hugely important you know, all the way through. You look Reaction save there by... are all over them at the moment. Just again. Turn around the corner by Nikita Paris. On each shin, where a larger shin pad might have helped you out there, Khadija Short. Stopped by Gemma Evans, but the clearance straight to Hasegawa. Cross comes in, dangerous one. Nodded just wide by Khadija Short. Casper had all the time in the world then to pick that pass out. You can see here there's no press on her whatsoever. I was surprised she actually crossed it in. And play, <laughs> so, uh... Just as capable as, as Jill Rod. Not, not got as many appearances or goals this season. But we have got the team. It's going to be City to get us underway. Both you... sides needing a win. One by Rachel Williams, but it's good covering from Letitia and Blundell. Oh, Khadija Shaw with a lovely touch to get her into the penalty area. Brave goalkeeping from Fallon Tullis Joyce as she dives at the feet of the rangy Jamaican. A player of the physical stature of, of Bonnie Shaw. It's a launch by Williams. Blundell moves it on to Guerrero. Guerrero just lingers on it ahead. Trying to put some pressure on this ball high up the field. City are going to play out from the press. This is Hasegawa. Switch of play. Rachel Williams hobbling after it. As it stands, would still be progressing, I think, to the final eight of the competition because the two runner-up spots were held by Spurs and Sunderland, both on seven points, but Sunderland are currently trailing 3-0. So just confirmation, I've just double-checked it, Manchester United would still make it to the last eight. And Hem's able to get in between all three of them. Well, I think Hannah Blundell maybe moves the ball brilliantly well, doesn't she, Millie Turner? You know, you've got Fowler on an international, Australian internationals come off the bench, and Park again you know such a good attacking player and i think you know that from what we've seen there nikita paris did catch her but there's definitely a lot bit of gamesmanship going on and united in possession now need to try and keep possession and hasegawa to, to decide to do the cross but probably would have been better to have a shot city Careful in possession, and they get a bit fortunate too. Hasegawa. Yard box, it's never really dropped for a United player. Oh, Shazy with a lovely bit of skill on the edge of the penalty area. She's still going, pulls it back. Chance here for United.